All right, well, dirt pile times. Cozy and monster. Let's see what we got. Hopefully the trucks will survive today. Oh, geez. As I said, this jump is too small for this truck. Time to go slower. Oh. <laughs> oh. Come on. Yeah. Nice. Oh, and it just totally cut off. Ah. Oh, and it just did it again. Ah, what's going on? It's not hot. What the hell's going on here? Well, shit. Monster didn't last. Monster broke. But Cozy, as always, comes through, takes a beating. I'm happy to oblige the beatings. Yeah. Smoke is here. Helicopters are returning home. Update from the future. So the problem was the ESC. It was cutting out, so I unplugged the sensor wire and was testing it like that. It ran, but really rough, and it wouldn't go anywhere near top speed. This is a Hobbywing Max 8. They have a replacement program where basically you send in any ESC apparently 
and they will give you a discount on a replacement. They also do repairs. So I got in touch with them. They got back to me within a day or two and uh, the regular Max 8 G2 has been discontinued. So they offered to send me the new one, the Max 8 G2 S, which has a Bluetooth module for a significant discount. Um, and then even after shipping and duty, so they charged, I think, $30 to ship it up here to Canada, and then it was about $25 worth of duty. Even with that, it was still cheaper than any retail price up here. Shipping sounds crazy if you live in the US, but in Canada, it's not actually that bad to get something from the US for that amount. So anyways, I would definitely recommend checking that program out if you need a new ESC or a motor. Just contact customer service at Hobby Wing North America explain what's up they'll give you some price whatever usually it's a very nice discount from retail so they sent me this this got here in five days from when the ticket was completed so brand new g2s system and uh yeah so i'll put that in there and then we'll do a little video about that later but just wanted to update on what went wrong and just really happy with the service from hobby wing I've, I've run these in all my trucks i've been really pleased with their quality i definitely beat the hell out of them run them in the water i do all the stuff you're not supposed to do except for unplug the fan when i'm in the water that's crucial and they they, they take it you know this lasted two years before it finally packed it in and i beat the hell out of it watch my videos and you'll see so I'm a big fan of Hobby Wing and some people say they have bad customer service. I don't know. That was not my experience at all. So there you go. Check out the next video or whatever video when I have an update on installing this and testing it out. Thanks for watching.